What's up, Rhinestone Cowboys? This is another one of my uh, weekly song news videos. Uh, today we look at the song Fast Car, the new hit song by Luke Combs, who is a real country man's hero and one of the biggest uh, artists in the world right now. And just, just to give you an idea of how big of a song this is, uh, it's number one on the country charts, but it's also broken through to be number one on the mainstream pop charts, and that just doesn't happen. That's unheard of. So hats off to Mr. Combs for uh, making it happen. Now, it's such a bold song, such a bold thing to do. Uh, he appears to be questioning his gender in this song. There's a certain lyric where he says that he works at the market as a checkout girl. Now, this is such a courageous and bold move. Uh, country music today, say what you will, but a lot of people say it's probably, unfortunately, the most racist it's ever been. We had that whole Morgan Wallen incident, and now he's back on the radio inexplicably. Uh, things that make you go, hmm, to my fellow Redditors. And, uh... Before you say anything negative about uh, this video at all, I will have you know a lot of my mates say I'm a bit of a tomboy. So any of those critiques, you need to put aside your biases and, and push aside because I'm not going to have it. But uh, Luke Combs, uh, such a courageous thing to do. And the guy, he is a heterosexual. And by all accounts... Uh, he's a, take my word for it, he's a big time heterosexual. But for him to have this lyric in a song, to take this sort of risk, to be brave enough to do this, I could see this guy being the next big movie star. He's so, so bold. Uh, now, I looked around at all this and I toyed around with uh, Photoshop, with angles, with uh, the lighting on things, and I... Uh, looked at various versions of Luke Combs as a lady, and uh, I have a picture here that I did of him. Now, this one isn't the best one. I, I, in fact, cannot show you the most detailed ones that I did because it would immediately be flagged off of YouTube as a deep fake because it just looks so incredibly real. But you're going to like this. This is what I have here. Now, if uh, you can see that, uh, Luke's wearing his normal hat. Now, this is a, just a normal build hat. Because of the front perspective, it, it just looks a little bit off. But you can see he has long eyelashes. Ooh, now that is pretty. Uh, he has, he, look at his eyebrows there. They're drawn on like the ladies do. That's so artistic, so neat. You know how everybody loves those type of things. Uh, when the eyebrows get drawn on, they look so uh, unique and nice and artistic. Uh, he has silky, flowing, long hair. Wow, no, that looks good. Uh, he's wearing his signature plaid shirt, and he has big uh, lips. Look at those. Wow. And uh, you can tell it's drawn in purple. I hope you can see. Uh, purplish color, and the actual name of the color, I'll show you here, Red Hot Inferno, and in uh, Spanish there, you even see the word rogue, like they use in the makeup uh, products, so that's sort of a multi-layered drawing, when you're using the color purple, and uh, you're making a Luke into a woman, and you're using the color like that that's a pretty you gotta admit you gotta give me a little bit of credit there that's pretty deep layered thinking uh to do all that but obviously luke would make a very handsome lady uh and i might on a separate website put some of those other things that i've toyed with some of those other uh filters and everything up but uh man you gotta admit for him to do this and the fact that he looks that good when you make them look into a lady there's something going on here something that i think has a chance to really move this world forward in a uh 
in a positive way. And I've even got, if you remember the Wednesday Adams character from the hit Netflix uh, show, of probably been a few years ago now. Uh, I even have her wig that I've been toying around with, putting it on various pictures of him just to uh, see how all that looks. Now, the whole concept of the song, I sort of don't like because uh, fast car, uh, there's so many things that are so much faster than a car now. Maybe back in the 1920s, that would have been a good thing. But now we have planes, we have rocket ships, we have... Uh, trains uh, if you saw that new bullet train movie with brad pitt now you want to talk about fast so the whole thing about a fast car doesn't really uh do anything for me anymore in this day and age uh but this has been the song news of the week and we want to give credit to luke combs for the brilliant uh things he is doing so luke uh love you buddy